baby guys it's your girl t back in the buildings or whatever hey yo this is dirty <laughs> Today, today, I am going to do a cute and <laughs> um. I asked my Instagram story to ask me some questions because, like, y'all got questions, I got answers, hopefully, and um, that's the gag, that's the deal. So yeah, let's get started. Let me pull out my phone, pull out my receipts. This is gonna take me a cool minute to get to the questions. This is how long y'all have asked me, and plus my phone's gonna die. So the first question that I've gotten asked was from Sweet Melanie. She asked me, when are you posting videos on your YouTube? So basically, I don't know when I'm posting my videos on my YouTube channel. I think like, I think, when i start like having more of an available like schedule then it'll be more easier for me to post videos but as of like right now i'm leaning towards like posting youtube videos every weekend so let's just see if i stick with that and if i don't i apologize like i'm truly sorry but yeah let's just see if i stick with the every weekend posting a video type of thing but school schedule that's just gonna how that's just that's just how it's going to be yeah k elizabeth 1989 aka caitlin hey what's up girl hey she asked me um when are we gonna hang out i miss you he um we can hang out totally during the summer um i feel like as this year like as my school year keeps on going there's more and more things that are piling up we gotta choose a time and during the summer because that's when I'm available. Why do I sound like I'm very like popular? Like I'm not. I'm just me. Nobody even knows me. Anyway. Anyway. Crazy underscore AKA Maria. I love you, Maria. I love you, girl. She asked me what brushes you use and why are you so perfect? Oh. I'm not crying in the club you are um the brushes that i use i always go like in the description of like really all my makeup looks i post um when i post i say i use morphe and bh cosmetic brushes i sometimes use sonia brushes um but yeah and sometimes on anastasia brushes but not enough to say those are the brushes that i use so i mostly use those type of brushes and yeah if you are looking for if you're looking where to get the brushes i would recommend online because you'll get like coupons and like discounts amanda asked would you do my makeup or anyone's for that matter for an event or something as a business so i'm still trying to figure that out i have little like little things that i do well I, little things that I've been asked to do and some some of them are solid some of them are still iffy some of them are like um not gonna happen but it's an idea still um I don't know to be honest I don't know like it depends like how it depends where I go in life like I don't know I just I just see I don't know if I'm gonna do it as a business because I already kind of have like my plan together in life like where i want to go what i want to do and what i want to go to school for so i don't know if i'm gonna turn that into a business but like if i do y'all would know and yeah i would do your makeup yeah just you know let me know we can set a date set a time set, set up set a place you know i can do your makeup jackie my girl jackie oh, what a book she asked me how you so good at makeup and how do you have patience to do all that stuff you do so i'm gonna explain this to y'all really quick i'm super oily i'm sorry I used to be an artist like i used to draw people here let me show y'all i used to draw people so being in front of a mirror 
drawing on like myself isn't really different if that makes sense it really doesn't make sense but y'all will know so good lord so this is my drawing page i used to draw these people mm. And this is like literally the most ship happen drawing I've done. Um, it's Sister James and Sister Kim. Um, James Charles liked that picture and it got over 600 likes. So this one I am super proud of and will literally go back to if I were to meet him in real life and be like, I'm the one that drew this. So love me, acknowledge me, you know. But yeah, I used to draw, so like pretty much doing like just this is difficult, but also like it's something that I'm used to. So sitting in front of a mirror for hours isn't really a problem for me. It's more just something to do and just something to create and be creative about because not everybody can, you know, do what I do, if that makes sense. Not being disrespectful in a way, but just... Everybody has their own creative outlet, and that's when you just have to let everybody be creative themselves. I really do not know how I'm quote-unquote good at makeup. Everybody is good at makeup in their own ways, as I say. Everybody has their own creative outlet. I do have my times where I'm just like comparing myself to everybody. Whether you're famous or not famous, I still compare myself. Um, that's just me being a human, and I feel like... People, even myself, like talking to myself and people that do want to become like influencers or makeup artists, do not compare yourself to others because you will never be them and they will never be you. So it's like that comes for everything, to be honest. Like if you want to be a chef and um, I guess let's just say that you see this plate on Instagram and you're like, let me rec recreate this. You cannot expect it to come out the same exact way because everybody has their own creativity. Everybody has their own art. <sighs> everybody has their own outlet. And like, it really depends on you how much of an artist you are. If you have so many creative outlets, do not compare yourself to somebody else who might be higher than you, might be on the same level as you, or might be lower than you because you always have your different your different creative outlets you always have your different this your different that your different just different everything so do not compare yourself because that will just leave you in either a really cocky situation or in a really sad situation to where you will get really upset and really sad and be like i am not as good as this person i'm not good as that person so just do you and grow increase your abilities and do not drown yourself drown yourself in the negativity and just continue to be a positive and not put yourself in a negative negative area do not make yourself popular or known in a negative area starting with my mother thank you i love you so much you know i wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you i love you bro. anyway she asked me, where do you see yourself in five years? That's a good question. I don't know. I see myself in five years, like in college, hopefully. And just kind of doing what I want to do in life and being successful. Um, we're not being successful, like succeeding in life. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like when life, take, life takes you places and life gives you so many opportunities and obstacles that makes you human and i feel like people really need to understand that that not everybody's gonna be perfect so when i look at myself in five years i see somebody who is going to obviously increase in the status quo if that makes sense but also is be human and also be like and also succeed like I don't know how to answer that question like life takes you like life takes you in specific directions and if you think about it I always tell this to people I'm always saying because I read this with my one of my best friends I read this quote and it said 
every decision you make changes your whole life and that's literally so true if you think about it and it's like dang like that's chills so i don't know where i'm gonna see myself in five years hopefully um being somebody hopefully having a esthetician esthetician um skincare line i don't know where i want to be i don't know i have a plan for myself i have like a foundation for myself but i just i don't know where i'm going to be in that time frame questions which are how are you able to detail how, how are you able to be so detailed in your looks so i don't know how to answer that question either because um i'm an artist so i know where shadows highlights i just i know where everything needs to be and i kind of have to pit i have i kind of have to um think of it as if i'm painting again or i'm drawing again because it's all the same thing it's just on a, a different um sensitive canvas so for an example i always use this brush it's a very fine very fine tip brush and it's definitely helps with detailing with like um lighter colors or darker colors any of that sort it just really helps me out um I just know where things needs to be. I really don't know how to explain it because you just kind of have to see me do it, which is also a link in the bio for my Greek mythology makeup. Um, <laughs> um, link in the bio for my Greek mythology makeup look if y'all want to see me turn into like a Greek goddess. You know what I'm saying? Like, we love that. But yeah, I really don't know how I can explain that because it's really just me as an artist to be honest i don't know i don't know how to explain a lot of these questions because i'm like such a beginner in like the makeup kind of world and i don't know everything yet so yeah who would you choose to do a collab with if you could choose an influencer i don't know who i would collab with i think i would probably collab with jackie or I would collab with Patrick Star. Oh yes, Patrick Star for sure. And then I would want to collab with Capricorn. Oh my God, y'all. Let me show y'all her makeup really quickly. Um, her makeup, sus. Her makeup. Oh my God, is literally so amazing. Like, can we just like appreciate this? I would literally love to collab with her. Like, honestly, like I would love to do that. So, Izzy Grace 03. Hey girl. Um, she asked me a few questions as well. She asked me, um, I'm, well, she didn't ask. She said, I'm on Snapchat. Girl, I will as this video. Um, she also asked me, um, what makeup wipes do you use? So I use Neutrogena makeup wipes, but I do use oil as well to take off like really like everything that I have on. Cause on like in the description of everything, I always use liquid lipsticks. So it's kind of hard to take that off with just a makeup wipe. But yeah, I use um, cleansing oil and I also use Neutrogena, Neutrogena makeup makeup wipes see ask me favorite food Ooh, ah! um i don't know i really do not know my favorite makeup i don't really know my favorite food i don't know because ever since i cut meat out of my life i oh i love spaghetti but spaghetti has not been the same since i've cut meat meat out of my life um the thing i'm craving right now is potato soup and nobody has gave me potato soup yet or some kind of set about but it's all right it's okay it's all right it's okay but i'm not sad about that you know it's okay like people are human I can't make you, you know, um, 
I can't make nobody make me some tail suit. I mean, I can make it, but I don't know how to. I gotta look it up on YouTube. But, yeah, like... I don't know. I love all type of food. I, oh, my God. Yes, wait. I don't know. I really do not know. Oh. I don't know. I think if I were to say potato soup, I'm sorry, like, potato soup sounds so good. Oh. May she ask, also ask me favorite makeup brand. Um. I don't know what's my favorite makeup brand, to be honest. Um, Jeffree Star, I would say he's on that list. Um, I, I like Couture. I love artist Couture. Like, literally, their highlight is blinding. When I'm not having one of those days where, like, my skin is super oily, like, that's when, like, the highlight takes over. You know what I'm saying? As of like everything, like everything that goes on my face, I love Too Faced as my foundation. That's like my favorite like foundation that I've used so far. Favorite store, aka clothing. Um I don't know. Cause like I haven't bought like variety of clothing to tell y'all like my favorite favorite but my favorite is forever 21 they got cute clothes there you know very cute but i'm gonna try fashion nova because i heard really good things about it and it's very beneficial for curvy people and i need that so i'm gonna try that out and then i'll get back to you on that <laughs> So, this was my birthday. My birthday is August 26th. Yes, I accept gift cards. Um, no, I'm just playing. I accept love and appreciation. And yeah, that's what I accept. Um, last question. Maria asked me again, why are you so perfect? Girl. 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 I don't know. I wish I knew the answer to your question. <sighs> anyway. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, okay. Big announcement, big announcement, big announcement, big announcement. So. Your girl going to LA Thursday, this upcoming week. It's a competition that I'm going to, which is Pro Star. It's this culinary competition where you gotta make three, three, um, three, what's that word? Um, we gotta make a appetizer, entree, and a dessert, but two of each plate. And I'm sister scared. I'm shaking in my boots. I am nervous because, like, I've never done this before, and we have to do all of that under an hour, and that's kind of hard. So, I've been really stressing out, and I have to be honest, like, I haven't been too focused to do makeup lately because of, like, how much stressful I've been, if that makes sense. I don't know. Like, it's just, it's really, like, it's shaking in my boots, you know? Like, I don't know what's going on but basically i'm not gonna be posting any makeup looks for for probably about like a week yeah i'm not gonna be posting any makeup looks for about a week hopefully if i get some really cool pictures i will post it on my you know my account but as of makeup wise i won't posting any pictures because I'm gonna be there for I'm gonna be there till Thursday and leaving Sunday and then this whole week I have finals so 
it's kind of like shaking, you know what I'm saying? Like able to be consistent as I would like. And that's why I was trying to do back to back to back looks this last, well, this week, well, last week or whatever. I was trying to do that, but I was getting super tired because I would literally post every day like at 1 p.m. And I just, I couldn't do that to myself. And I feel like if I do that all the time, then I will burn out. Uh, I, I will burn out of gas and I will not post any makeup looks at all realistically speaking so yeah um I just need to focus on what I need to focus on and get that done and hopefully after that I will post a really dope freaking cool makeup look because I have so many ideas and people send me so many things and hopefully I can come out with a video of me like recreating those makeup looks in under like 10 minutes like like a challenge video like that'll be super cool super fun super festive and yeah that's my announcement um don't unfollow me don't unsubscribe you know i'm gonna try to post tomorrow but if not don't be mad because that's not my intentions but yeah i hope you guys like this video it's so um I don't know what else to say. I hope you guys like my video. And stay positive. Stay radiant. Stay glowing. We love that for us as well. Um Okay, bye.